All right, guys. So it's Sunday morning, and uh, so it's Sunday morning, Sunday after the get down. And uh, in the last video, you guys heard me talking about Dino's get down and stuff. Unfortunately, I didn't get to go out as much as I wanted. I had to work Friday all day, and then work again Saturday. So. I made it out there for just a little while. I didn't get any video or any kind of footage like that. Um, like I said, I just I just went out there for uh, like about an hour or so, talked to talked to all the guys that I knew, and then uh, got out of there. So sorry guys, I didn't get any footage or anything like that of it. Um, but if you guys want to see some footage, there's tons of channels on here that were there uh, covering it. I know. Uh, Greaser Thoughts Garage, William over there, that channel. He's got a bunch of footage from it. Go check him out. And then here soon, I'm sure, uh, Grinder TV will also have a really nice video covering the whole event. You guys go check that out there too. But like I said, it's, it's Sunday morning and I need to get this garage cleaned up um, and organized. I've let it go way too long. <laughs> I also need to make room because so all last week I drove the C10 to work and I realized there's a few things that it kind of needs to be a little bit more comfortable a little bit nicer to drive like I mentioned in the last video I really want to redo the exhaust um, it's got a few leaks plus um, right here as I was saying before it just dumps right here um, in front of the axle and when you're sitting at the stoplight and stuff quite a bit of fumes get inside the truck so in order to work on that truck in my garage I need to free up some space um, like you can see I got a bunch of shit on the floor um, there's still stuff scattered everywhere over here my goal is to get this area over here kind of cleaned up and organized a little bit better so that there's room to uh, push the s10 over here against the side I don't know if you can kind of see kind of push it over there and into the corner so that I have all this room over here for the C10 so I can pull it in and start working on it. Um, this garage with those cabinets isn't quite deep enough for the uh, C10 to fit and be able to open and access that stuff. So when I'm working on the C10, I'm probably gonna have to open the garage, roll it out a little bit and work on it, but be better than working on it out in the garage plus just kind of keep everything inside neat and neat and clean don't want to look like a junkyard out here with uh, these trucks all tore apart but so that's the goal today is just get this garage cleaned up and organized kind of get the s10 tucked over there in the corner um, I've got these wheel dollies that make it super easy they're over here in the corner but I got those wheel dollies that make it super easy to kind of push it over in the in the corner and, and get it out of the way but I also have a whole bunch of stuff, most of it's Christmas stuff, decorations and things that I brought from the storage unit to uh, to uh, get set up in here. Yep, today's, today's project is getting this garage finally cleaned up and organized. It's just been, been a thrash the last couple of months getting the S10 finished and to the track and everything and, and uh, I just, it's time to clean up now. So that's what we're going to do. We're gonna cue the time lapse of cleaning this garage because I know that's long and boring. You guys don't wanna watch the whole thing, so here's the time lapse. So with a fab table and grinders comes metal dust. And I noticed over here underneath my floor mat, this metal dust has actually started to rust and kind of embed in the flooring, so I'm gonna, I got this, uh, got me a little bit of CLR here. I'm gonna see if uh, I can get this rust to come off.
All right, check it out. We got all this side cleared out, cleaned up, room for the S10 to move over, move the welding table up over there, gives a little extra room over here. Um, still got to do this side, but we're going to ignore that, just ignore that. We're going to look at what I did get done, and that's right here, this beauty. So now it's just get the S10 on the wheel dollies and get her situated over here into her new little sleeping spot. Well, doesn't quite fit as well as I thought it was going to. Still got a little bit of room, but I'm not going to be able to get from the door out to here. Uh, and it's leaking ATF again. Damn it. <sighs> what am I going to do? Well, it's tight. I had to move my saw. I have to find somewhere else to put it, but I can still squeeze through there. So it's tight. Now I just need to finish cleaning up all this stuff. Ugh. <sighs> 